As we all know, our skin is the largest organ in our body that serves as the first line of defense against external threats. It protects us from intense UV rays, bacteria, viruses, and other environmental pollutants that can turn our lives upside down. In fact, without it, we'd literally evaporate. But do you know that our skin can also be a reflection of our internal health? Whether it's hormonal imbalances, vitamin deficiencies, or even underlying medical conditions, our skin can tell a lot about what's going on inside our body. But if you have kidney disease, you won't see early signs of damage until it progresses and becomes more severe. That's why it's vital to pay attention to any changes in your skin, as they may be an indication of kidney failure. In this video, we'll discuss the top 5 skin signs of kidney disease that you should never ignore, no matter what. While these symptoms may not necessarily mean that you have kidney disease, it's always better to be safe than sorry. So, without any further ado, let's dive right into it and learn more about how to identify kidney failure symptoms through our skin and why it's crucial to take them seriously. But first, let's take a look at why kidney disease can affect our skin in the first place. Well, the main reason is that the kidneys play a crucial role in filtering waste and toxins from our blood. When they fail to do so, these harmful substances can build up and cause various issues, including changes in our skin. For example, high levels of phosphorus in the body can lead to dry and itchy skin. It can also cause changes in our sweat glands, which can result in dryness and irritation. So, now that we understand the connection between kidney disease and skin health let's move on to the top 5 skin signs of kidney disease. Pruritus or itching. Extremely itchy skin, also known as pruritus, is one of the most common skin symptoms that patients with kidney disease experience. It can range from mild to severe and can significantly disrupt a person's daily life. In fact, studies have shown that around 50 to 90 percent of patients on dialysis experience pruritus, while approximately 15 to 49 percent of people with chronic kidney disease are also affected by it. The itching is often worse at night and can spread all over the body or be localized in a specific area. Scratching can lead to raw and bleeding skin, thick leather-like patches, or itchy bumps. It may also be a sign of other underlying conditions, so it's crucial to consult a dermatologist if you experience persistent itching that gets worse with time. While there's no cure for pruritus, some management tools can provide temporary relief. These include using emollients or moisturizers, undergoing ultraviolet phototherapy, and taking medications like activated charcoal and nalfurifine. However, it's important to note that these treatments may not work for everyone, and it's best to consult a dermatologist for personalized advice. Diabetes, thyroid problems, liver disease, anemia, multiple sclerosis, and allergic reactions can all cause pruritus, so in case your skin is itchy, don't just assume it's due to kidney disease. It's always better to get a proper diagnosis from a medical professional to ensure proper treatment. Extremely dry skin. Another common sign of kidney disease is excessively dry skin or xerosis. It will make your skin feel tight, rough, and scaly, just like a fish. This is because kidney disease can cause blockages in your sweat glands, which lead to decreased or no sweating at all. The lack of sweat can make your skin extremely dry, leading to cracks or fissures on the surface, which can easily become infected. People who have end-stage kidney disease and require dialysis or a kidney transplant are more prone to developing extremely dry skin because their kidneys do not filter or remove toxins from their bodies efficiently. This buildup of toxins can cause significant harm to the skin, leading to various skin conditions like psoriasis and eczema. The fish-like scaly skin is so sensitive that even scratching can cause further damage and worsen the condition. If you want to keep your skin healthy, you can use natural oils like olive, almond, or jojoba oil to moisturize your skin. Also, avoid taking hot showers or baths, as it can strip the skin of its natural oils and make it even drier. If you're experiencing intense dryness that doesn't go away with simple moisturizers, it's best to consult a dermatologist to determine the underlying cause of your dry skin, it could be due to kidney disease or maybe a different medical condition. Changes in skin color. The next important sign of kidney disease is changes in skin color and appearance. When the kidneys stop working as they should, they are unable to filter out toxins from the blood effectively. As a result, these toxins can accumulate in the body and cause various changes to the skin's color and texture. Some common skin color changes associated with kidney disease include a gray or yellow hue to the skin, an unhealthy pale tone, darkened skin areas, and spots and cysts that resemble whiteheads. These changes can occur anywhere on the body but are most commonly seen on the arms, legs, and face, especially around the eyes and mouth. 
It can also cause hyperpigmentation, a condition where certain areas of the skin become darker than the surrounding skin due to an increase in melanin production. If you notice any changes in your skin color, don't let it go unnoticed and unattended. These changes could be an indication of underlying kidney disease or another health issue that requires medical attention. So be sure to consult a doctor for proper diagnosis and treatment. In the meantime, you can also take steps to protect your skin by using sunscreen, wearing protective clothing, and avoiding excessive sun exposure, which can worsen hyperpigmentation. But again, remember, these skin changes can also occur in other diseases. Swelling. Healthy kidneys are the body's filtration system that removes excess fluid and salt from the body. Just like how a filter works, the kidneys play an essential role in maintaining the body's fluid balance. However, when your kidneys are not able to function properly, excess fluids and salt can build up in the body. This can lead to swelling or edema in various parts of the body. Swelling is a common sign of kidney disease and is often one of the first symptoms that people notice. It occurs due to the accumulation of fluid in tissues under the skin, causing them to swell and become puffy. In some cases, the swelling can be severe enough to leave an indentation when pressed. The most common areas where people experience swelling due to kidney disease include the ankles, legs, hands, feet, and face. This is because these body parts are more prone to fluid retention compared to other areas of the body. Swelling in these areas can be particularly uncomfortable and can make it difficult for individuals to move around or perform daily activities. While it can also occur due to other medical conditions, kidney disease should not be overlooked as a potential cause of swelling. If you notice persistent swelling in any part of your body, stop focusing on the symptom and seek medical advice to identify the underlying cause. Calcium deposit under the skin. The fifth skin-related sign of kidney disease is a bit more obscure and is often overlooked. It is the presence of calcium deposits under the skin. As we all know, our kidneys have several jobs, one of them is to balance certain minerals in our blood, including calcium. When the kidneys are unable to maintain a healthy balance, levels of these minerals can rise and cause issues throughout the body. Calcium deposits under the skin are a clear indication that something is wrong with your kidneys. They typically appear near joints and are not painful unless they form within one of your fingertips. Calcium deposits under the skin can take various forms. Some people may develop small bumps or lumps that feel hard to the touch. Others may experience a chalky discharge if one of these deposits breaks through the skin surface. Also, keep in mind that these deposits can also be a sign of other health conditions like infections and hypercalcemia. Therefore, don't ignore the presence of calcium deposits under your skin and consult a doctor for proper diagnosis and treatment. Also, they are not just limited to the skin, they can also appear in other parts of the body, including blood vessels, tendons, and organs, so be aware of any unusual symptoms and seek medical attention. While these top 5 skin-related signs can be indicative of kidney disease, it is indispensable to keep in mind that they can also occur due to other health conditions. There are also some other skin issues that can arise as a result of kidney disease, such as a lump in the belly, discolored nails, rashes, scratch marks, and blisters that do not heal. We strongly recommend that if you experience any of these symptoms, you should consult a doctor immediately for proper evaluation and treatment. As the saying goes, prevention is better than cure, so make sure to take care of your kidneys by maintaining a healthy lifestyle and getting regular checkups. Also, one thing that I want to mention is that the information provided in this video is gathered from various sources, including AAD.org, news-medical.net, and for seniorskidneycare.com. If you want to learn more about the topic, please check out these sources for more comprehensive information. And in the end, as we always say, if you love what you see here, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to our channel for more exciting content related to health and wellness. Until next time, stay healthy and happy.